myself in paper, I'm gonna dump myself glue. Stick some stamps on top of my head, I'm gonna mail myself to you. I'm gonna tie me up in red string, I'm gonna tie blue ribbons too. Gonna climb up in my mailbox, I'm gonna mail myself to you. Cut the string and let me out Wash the glue off of my fingers Stick some bubble gum in my mouth Take me out of my wrapping paper Wash the stamps off of my head Fill me full of ice cream soda Stick me in a nice warm bed Dear Jason, how are you doing? Spring's great here with all the flowers blooming. You've read a book about Flat Stanley in class. He was flat because a bulletin board fell on him while he was sleeping. Ours is yours. We kind of have a humble little place here, but I'm glad you're able to show. Um, I'm still not sure I understand what this is about. Is this some kind of a ploy? the teacher to get the kids to, to write letters, maybe find pen pals, just an excuse. What is this? Hmm. I tend to think it's somewhat of a conspiracy. People I don't know invading my home to find out things about me about my private life. Seems like a strange, strange joke. Seems like something Barb would do. Well, would you like a glass of tea? I know so you didn't, you're traveling kind of light, but maybe we'll see what we can do. Maybe Beth will be home soon. I should probably know something where we, some place where we might be able to find some. Find an extra little outfit for you or something. Well, I take it you're in the folk songs by your shirt, so. What do you say we uh, sit down and pick and grin a little? I don't know what you can play, but uh, how about on this one you play the Seishara?
During Stanley's visit, Mary Beth and I traveled to upstate New York with our friend Vincent. We passed through six states and three state capitals, including Richmond, Harrisburg, and Columbia. Stanley is a very quiet individual, and as hard as I've tried, I was unable to get him to talk. He remains a mystery. However, during our travels and adventures, we met lots of great people and heard many great stories, and for that, I am thankful. Ha, ha, ha.